Welcome to Stadium Eats. We're here. It's Yankees Red Sox. I have a very special guest with me, Joey, on Twitter, baseball threat. I think my we we hung out for most of the game, so it's like the fifth inning. You're my I think you're my favorite British person of all time. Because here's the thing. I'm a baseball nerd. Yeah. I love baseball. But I get that it's boring and you've decided to leave every part of your comfort. Essentially, the world. You went to Japan, Japan, yeah, South Korea, uh, now the USA. I'll be up in Canada later in the summer, so uh, I'm you, having the best time, AJ. Uh, yeah, I mean, you love baseball. I love baseball. Yeah, it's uh, having an early midlife crisis. I'm taking out my life savings. I'm doing this just because I want, I want to you know, spread my love of baseball really to people originally back in the UK and Europe, but now just to anybody who's following along, just get out to your local pub, have the best time, get some peanuts, get a hot dog, get some beers, and yeah. Enjoy this sport because it's fantastic. So let me ask you, why baseball and not cricket or footy? <laughs> right? Why why is it baseball for you and not those sports that are like easily accessible? Yeah, like uh, so to be honest, it was it was soccer for me football when I was living in England. But I left England uh, five years ago, moved to Asia. Baseball is king in Japan and in South Korea. I watched a lot of uh, baseball games in those two countries. Uh, the time difference made it very difficult to follow soccer in, in Europe. Um, yeah, games were like one in the morning, two in the morning. And uh, so I started replacing soccer with baseball. And now I'd say baseball is my favorite sport. The people I've met, the experience I've had, the fun times at the ballpark. I think, I think it's the superior sport now for me personally. So your goal is 162 games this year between yeah. Major League, minor league, independent league, independent league, independent yeah, league independent and all over the place. So what next is all done? Is there a part of you that says like I want to move to America? Or I think like when this is done, like to be honest, uh, every day of the minute it's so exciting, it's such a rush, like driving to somewhere new or you know meeting new people like yourself, JJ tonight and stuff. Spin strikes, but when this ends after 162 games, I think I'll be ready to go home for a little bit in England and spend some time with my sister, my niece, my mum, my dad, my dog, and just take stock of everything. And hopefully, wait, wait about this experience. And then when the baseball season starts again next next year, I don't want to be back in the USA like that. Well, I'm excited. So, if you look at my Twitter profile, I'm retired from reading, so I don't read books. <laughs> so, there would be a big fan. Yeah, audio audio yeah. Or, even better, a TV show. Uh, that does it for me. I will definitely, I will watch that show. But, so, since you're here, Yankees Red Sox. Yeah, we've got these, these bad boys. We've got one of, if you take away our politics, this is the worst thing America has to offer. Oh, this is brilliant. It's a soda. Massive soda. Uh, with on top of it, hot chicken fingers and french fries. And from all the things that I've done uh, at all stadiums, this is probably the like most well-known thing I feel like at Yankee Stadium, and I haven't done it before. It's so convenient, like, it's so helpful. Like for someone as weak as I am. Must no, be. I feel like this is <laughs> you get work I out. just I just spilled some. But this out. is it is. You need some reps on it. It's a rep. The good thing is that Andrew West City next to us is not here because he's a double dip. Because he'll take a bite and then he'll dip again. This is scumbag. Double dip right in that motherfucker. Very naughty. Very naughty. Very naughty. Very naughty. Very naughty. And you're very naughty. You're kind of a cunt. <laughs> very bloody hell. Very naughty. That word is very rude. Very naughty as well. Also naughty. Alright. We're going to rate this in a second. What? Which Spice Girl is your favorite Spice Girl? Uh, easy for me. Posh Spice. Posh? Victoria Beckham. Now it's Victoria Beckham. I'm a Baby Spice guy myself. Yeah, Baby Spice, I'm a bunch of like, you know, big girl and stuff, but uh, I think you're wrong. Uh, but I, the fact you've got some 
giving it to that so you can bet like happily. So, on a scale of 1 to 10, with this, we have Pepsi inside. So is it Pepsi? Yeah. Current Pepsi. Getting a lovely aroma of tender as I enjoy the soda as well, which I like personally. <laughs> Sat with you, this lovely weather, watching this incredible game against the Red Sox. The fact the Yankees are up, I've got to give this at least an 8 out of 10. 8. So, I think it's one of the worst things we offer as a society. Disagree. Just the, the, the comfort as a country, we're very bad. But, and you're far off. Remedies. I wish I snuck in maybe like an airplane bottle of Jameson to dump in here. Okay, fair enough. You see me coming from that. And I think it's doable. Security here is not great. Um, I'm going to give this a 7. So we're not totally far off. Hey, like, I think it's great. So when it comes to the London series, yes, have you been to Fenway? I've been to Fenway, yeah, I have been uh, earlier this season and uh, once before. They're terrible people. Will you be cheering one side or the other? Um, or are you just hoping for a good turnout? Well, I'm really hoping that people back home just give baseball a chance and uh, they come out and watch these two, you know, these two story teams in this intense rivalry and have a great time. But, uh, yeah, whilst I'm sat with the Yankees fans, then obviously, you know, Ron Smith tribes, you know, don't want the Yankees to win. They're Red Sox home games, but uh, the Yankees at the minute, they've got a great team, so. We'll see. We'll see what happens. We're excited for the London series. We're going to be out there. We're both going to be out there. We're going to hang out, mate. I'm excited. We're going to have a pint. I fancy a pint. Definitely, mate. Yeah. Mate. I appreciate you coming on. I appreciate what you're doing for the game of baseball as a baseball nerd. I wish Andrew wasn't here, but we're dealing with the situation. Hey. We got a lot of stadium.